All right, how are we doing, guys? My name is Ben. This is Andrew. And we're continuing the early Volume 7 journey um, with uh, Chapter 8, uh, Cordially Invited. Uh, go ahead and do the thing. So last episode, we got a little bit of uh, info all around. Um, we got to uh, the footage got out of Penny mm -hmm, uh, supposedly mm -hmm, killing mm -hmm, those people. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But we all know who it really was. Um, so it cuts to her dad analyzing her footage trying to get the real footage out of what she saw at that night and then um in the process we learn that he is actually the reason she has aura because he is taking aura from himself and putting it placing it onto her so she actually has aura from him infused so we learned that but we also learn that he when he loses his aura he doesn't get it back or anything he's just genuinely losing aura so he and he pretty much says that he wouldn't be able to make her a third time, right? If they got rid of her, yeah. It's pretty much his long lines as he made it. So, uh, pretty much. So this is the last and final penny we have. So if anything happens, it happens type of thing. So we got that information, and then he kind of gave us a little bit. Us uh, uh, in a way, he also told us another part of piece of information that now Mister Schnee has access to the security codes because he said anyone on the council. You know, along with all these other people have access to security codes and well Mr. Schnee is now part of the council so now he has access to security codes uh, meaning that aka Watts who is working with him will now have access to security codes and uh, for instance like you pointed out uh, that would be the reason that footage got all over the place he was able to go into Mantle and Atlas's stuff and get it all over everywhere so um, that's that uh, what, did the, what did we end on? What did it end on in the episode? I'm trying to remember where we ended. Because I know we had the talk and then it uh, uh, Oscar and Ironwood. Oscar. At, talking about, and at the staff area. Is that where it ended? Oh, yes, that's right. Because they went okay. to the staff. Oh, yeah, that's right. And we also found out that the staff is actually what's holding up Atlas. Mm -hmm. And that if it is used for anything else, the city will fall. So, like we talked and like you said, it was smart because it's like a counter thing where it's like, well, you know... If anyone dares to steal the staff, all they're going to do is destroy the city. So, touch it at your own risk, pretty much thing. Well, so, use it. Use it at your so own risk. So apparently, yeah. that's the uh, um, what's the what's the word? That's like the rule. I, I forget. There's a special rule, yeah. a special word for it. I forget. I forget. Well, I guess you can grab it and you could go as far as you want. I guess, but if you use it, it's automatically going to take. It's like I want a hamburger. Oh, I just accidentally killed. Thousands and thousands Millions of, of people, people, you know, whatever. <laughs> it's like, my bad. <laughs> Whoops, that cheeseburger was worked though. But it was good, though. Yeah. yeah. Double meat. So then after they have their talk, uh, yeah, what's his name? Walks up, or go, they go up the elevator, they bump into Winter and Penny, and he is given an invite to go to a dinner with Mr. Schnee to talk about his seat at the council. Mm-hmm. So, well, that's where we're at. And also, Ironwood was, um questioning why salem is the way she is yeah that's right why so she... why she was like he was like why uh like does she feel fear you know does... that's why he was asking is she even human well she know. he knows that well i don't well maybe she maybe he doesn't know i don't think he knows yet yeah, but she, i mean i don't think he knows yet that she's this unkillable witch so yeah so. i'll find out no he about to find out right quick. Well, we're gonna get started um doing all do all the algorithm stuff it'll help and if you want to um, have some influence on future shows, check out the Patreon. Bing bada boom. I'm lightning boy. Gonna save you from this trap. Travity. I got balls. <laughs> it's lagging, bro. Oh, it's a lag. It's getting hacked. Wall hacks. Super wall hacks. <laughs> Believe, and now you see. Still makes me happy every time I see it. <laughs> I've seen it a thousand times. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, was she in the opener? Yeah. Wait a second, was she in the opener in the first couple episodes? 
Uh, yeah, but she was introduced in the first one. It's at the end of the first episode. First, uh, oh, that's right, that's right, that's right, that's right, that's right. That's right. But they usually release the uh, the openers early. Uh -huh. But um, for 7 8, they didn't. Uh -huh. But starting with 7. The 7 was like the first one that they didn't release the early. And this is what I understand. I could be wrong, but I don't, I don't think I am. Um, but they didn't release this one because they were like, there's spoilers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. So. AKA Penny. <laughs> So you told me there was a spoiler in number eight? A hostile takeover into a fuffy PR move. On the news, Mrs. he just wanted to break bread and hash things out. Yeah, zibba zabba, zibba zabba, zibba zabba zee. We do want the general to start opening up to these people, right? Yeah, but on his terms. Ironwood's going to be locked in a room at his rival's own dinner party. I know Jacques says he's happy to moderate, but all that really means is he'll be the one controlling the conversation. Not hard to imagine how that's gonna play out. I still can't believe he won. Robin was supposed to be the people's champion, wasn't she? There's just too many coincidences. You really think your dad might have something to do with Salem? I think mm -hmm. my father would do whatever it takes to win. And we should do the same. Meaning... Well, no one knows your dad better than you. And out of everyone going tonight, I'd say you're the only one who could snoop around the house and not be questioned. True. If Jacques Schnee's up to something... I think we should know what it is. Facts. Facts. Figgity figgity facts, my guy. Suppose we should smile for the cameras? Sir, with all due respect, you'd have to pay me. I'm going to go back home. Good evening, everyone. Where's Klein? What an interesting way to say, hello, dear brother. How have you been? <laughs> what a douche. I'm afraid you won't find him here. He was let go. Oh. I can't imagine why. General, exactly how large do you think our dining room table is? I happen to know it's enormous. But most of my guests will be on standby in case the council requests additional eyewitnesses. Until then, I'm sure they'll be happily celebrating. Father. <laughs> I happen to know it's enormous. <laughs> wow. Oh, yeah, rich people again. Whoop whoop. For those rich of you joining people us everywhere. The diner, please follow me. We can get another Weiss episode where she screams Wish at them. Luck. Maybe. I mean, they already invited you, didn't they? <laughs> Care for a drink, sir? Uh, no, no, no thanks. I think I'll just stick to patrolling the grounds. Rip, Drunkle Crow. Words out of my mouth. That's the breast. Right, that's the well, best crow. Don't wander off. Don't said the breast crow. Breast Be crow. Ready in case the general calls on you. Orders. Let's see them out of house and home. Counterpoint, how about we do wander off, consider breaking things, and then all that other stuff? I'll be in touch. Dear sister, I was hoping we could use this time to catch up. Just punch oh, I have to know. Why did you go through so much trouble to leave home only to come crawling back? <sighs> <laughs> this might be a problem. Is it eating an Oreo? What is that? It looks like an Oreo. It looks like an Oreo. <laughs> an Oreo on a stick. <laughs> this is a fancy Oreo. Yeah. <laughs> Balloon Don't tree. Yeah, yeah. Councilwoman Camilla. Councilwoman Hill would have had a nice ring to it. Though I suppose I should just be grateful I got invited to the table. <laughs> Miss Hill, that vigor of yours is precisely why we're grateful to have you with us tonight. What is she doing here? What we're all doing here, James, addressing the concerns of our kingdom. Which means we have much to discuss. Indeed. I was hoping we could start by- Are we safe with her here, by the way? I do recall some confusion regarding her involvement in that horrific massacre. As the official report stated, that footage was doctored. 
Penny is completely under my control. Which is concerning, I think. Concerning? Let's talk about exactly what it is you control. Uh oh. Uh oh. Why won't this kid buzz off? We need to do something. Buzz off, man. What was that earlier about breaking things? <laughs> Well, Whitley, I'm sure the company is lucky to have you. But if you'll pardon me... And where exactly is it that you're going? Careful! Messy food coming through! Right, <laughs> the company has promised me my own parking space. Maybe. Care for a drink? Don't mind if I do! Oh no! Look out! I'm going to go get some more things. Did she perfectly throw it on Whitley? <laughs> That's where it's going. <laughs> Look at Ren, he's smiling. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, I dyed my hair, sis. If you'll excuse me. It's a new look. <laughs> uh, <laughs> So I'm going with this purple hair look, dude. It's pretty sick. I can't. Only the issue is that there's nothing on the floor. Yeah. Apparently, it all hit her. I did see that. Yeah. That's fine. Few years, James. But what we need now is for you to work with us, sir. I have. It's obvious that no kingdom intends to declare war on Atlas. We have no angry. In the <laughs> yeah. Haven. We have proof our drones weren't acting on orders at Beacon. At this point, the closure of Atlas borders is only serving to hurt our relationship. Is she now like sitting in the same room as her dad at all? I... The rest of the world? It's hurting us. The people of Atlas are suffering, and they want to know why. Quite right, Ms. Hill. And I'm afraid there's more than just your choices that have brought harm to our citizens as of late. Have your forces found any additional evidence as to who is slaughtering innocent civilians down in Mantle? That is an ongoing investigation, the details of which are classified, I'm afraid. I'm afraid of the ever-growing list of classified information you seem to be keeping. I asked our fellow councilman here to shed some light on your Amity Coliseum project, and as it turns out, they know about as much as I do. Even you don't know? The Amity Project will help with all of the issues you present, mm. but you have to understand that discretion is a top priority at this time. Are you saying you don't trust us? You can't just buy trust like everything else. You have to earn it. I couldn't have said it better myself. General, if I may be blunt, <laughs> you have spent what little trust this council had left in you. The hacker who turned Atlas drones against us was never captured. Whoever's been murdering your critics is still at large. How are we supposed to give you our trust when you've given us nothing as of late? That's not what- Winter. That's enough. Excuse me. Why is Penny not got food, huh? Yeah, just because she's a robot. She's robot. racist. She should have food too. Give her some mm. oil or something. This <laughs> <laughs> gives her like five, like five W four or something. Like that. <laughs> Here, check it out. I'm fine, thank you. Keep up the great work. It's Watson. Hello, there. darling. Her mom. Mama Schnee. Are you okay? Mama Schnee. I'll be fine. I just let my emotions get the better of me. What do you mean? You wouldn't understand. Oh. Right. Uh, no, no. What I mean is, <laughs> this place holds a lot of memories for me specifically. I thought I was in control, but you heard me. I sounded like a petulant child. I thought you sounded fine. You were just speaking from your heart. And that is precisely the problem. I should have just stayed in line. I guess you're right. I don't understand. I like how they pay respect to like Penny's old school haircut though, because she's got like that 
her short hair, like right here, that looks like her old school <laughs> hair still. I'm sorry, I couldn't come down for your party. I'm Choices. afraid I'm not feeling well. <laughs> As she's holding the drink. <laughs> um, it's okay, Mom. It's fine. I think she got the baggy eyes and everything. What are you doing in your father's office? <laughs> Just looking for something I left. I heard. That's right, you left. You left. I need to use father's computer. Why? Because I think you may have done something. Something wrong. I thought we all simply assumed that at this point. Yes, the Ross <laughs> are trying to do something about it. Legend. Cho cho cho. It's a part. Locking his home computer. But he still has blind spots. You put a camera in here? I put them in every room of this house for our safety in case I ever need. The mom. I was naked. <laughs> Not the point, okay? <laughs> you saw my buttocks in my she, stuff. She gave birth there. It's fine. She's seen it all That's before. bullcrap. First of all, okay, that's the worst excuse ever. Yeah, I didn't come out as a grown man with a beard, but naked. And, and, you didn't. And, and, uh, <laughs> Mama, give me teat. Oh, okay. <laughs> No matter what happens, Weiss, oh. please don't forget about your brother. Whitley wants nothing to do with me. Of course not. You left him alone. With us. <laughs> True. Most broken couple ever. Yeah, this guy sucks. Who are you? Uh oh. Ah, man. My name's Watts. I stand in the rain because I just can. I don't think he's worried about it. He's got an umbrella. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm good. You know what all that is? What? Does he control the weather? Uh, not quite. Hey, Mom, it's snowing. Oh, no, that was the heat. Uh, what about the heat? Is that what kept them from freezing? Was they had like rapid heat pretty much? They had a heating grid, yeah? Yeah, and the heating grid is what made it rain instead of snow. Uh, well, what's what caught what's the difference between rain and snow? Yeah, well, one's not in freezing temperature and one's in freezing temperature. Okay, so he turned off the heat which was ca causing the frozen elements around them to turn into normal, like, well... Well, to ma maintain their frozen yeah, state. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, so now they're, now they're gonna freeze. Yeah. Um, so in chapter th three, um, Ruby had, had was like, she's like, ah, it's freezing. And uh, White said something along the lines of, yeah, the cold of Solitas can kill you in a man in a matter of hours without a projected aura. So, like, if you're just like a regular person, then you could die to the cold in a couple hours. <laughs> you don't think you he was like, yeah, Tyrion, you remember when you killed those, like, ten people? Yeah, yeah. I killed kill all the city. <laughs> this, is, this is intelligence. Yeah. Intelligence is scary. <laughs> so they're wow. talking about, they're trying to figure out why. 
right? So they're talking about the meeting. She says, yeah, like Jacques would do anything to win. So they, they go. Little, uh, little uh, funny tidbit here. I suppose we should smile for the cameras. Sir, with all due respect, you'd have to paint me. <laughs> so, I mean, <laughs> a little smile. Yeah. He's like, hey. I happen to know my oh dude honestly I'm I can agree with what with uh Whitley at this point Where's yeah time? this is this line an interesting way to say hello dear brother how have you been <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I would do that yeah that's pretty that's pretty good I like that <laughs> I was like, what a, what a great way of saying, hello then, how are you today? <laughs> <laughs> so they go. I happen um, to know how enormous your table is. <laughs> I happen worthy. to know it's enormous. Yeah. So, let's just see. So they're talking, right? Pretty basic stuff. Yeah. Here we have just these three. All right, so this is like a... A new, a new photo, I would imagine. Yeah. Because this is probably after when uh when or Weiss left. Yeah. Which means he's this the heir of the throne or heir of the company now. Yeah. So they are discussing. They they throw a little shade at Penny, because uh, she is the robot. Yep. Who uh, potentially did it? But they didn't serve her no food. No, no man. She no no oil. nuts or bolts or oil. Dude, nothing. That's foul, dude. Dude. I, even the Iron Giant had to eat some scrap. Come on, dog. So they go and uh, they get all this. Team Juniper, uh, they uh, they put in the work. And then this lady gets hit with everything. <laughs> like, uh, apparently none of it hits the ground. Just a little, just a little animation glitch, you yeah. know, error. You know, it's fine though. Yeah, Not, of course. There's no, no big deal. <laughs> <laughs> what if? Yeah, there's just yeah. nothing there. What if, what if it should like wise get to the top and then she just falls, <laughs> like falls down? <laughs> Retry. Um, so they're talking about um, no one here knows anything about Andy. Yeah. Right. So like you're so what the, from what they're seeing is you're taking resources and you're putting them over here for something that you're not telling us what it is when we need it to repair the wall down at Mantle. On top of you have a killer machine right next to you that just killed ten of our people. Potentially, yeah. Yeah, potentially, yeah. Which you say was debunked, but you know Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not factual yet. So, so yeah. And it's like uh so that's so that they don't know anything about Salem, right? Ironwood knows no. about Salem. Yeah, right? This yeah. everyone on the other side of the table, no, but this side knows about Salem. Yep. Right. The other side don't. What are they eating? Is that green beans? Got a uh, some Potatoes, steak and then steak. Yeah. What is that green sauce right there? Oh, it's a sauce. I don't know. He said, "Put that Kahuna sauce over there, my guy." And when you're just going to town, bro. Just, just. <laughs> So at you? this point, he she speaks out in his face. You have to earn he he knew. He's like, <sighs> he knew that it, it hit her in a certain spot. So he we've seen him in multiple ways use. You know, he pretty much just kept poking, like, to uh, because to, he knew Winter would uh, go over the edge. Yeah. So then we have she excuses herself. Excuse me. Because that's just another part of Ironwood's image, in a sense. She is. Hey, 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 hey. Winter, watch where you're going. Yeah, it, was knocked, it was knocked over. Oh, all that wine? All that wine, dude? God, dude. Your mama needs to get turned somehow. Toxic. Oh, snap. You got some pictures. So this is uh, Grandpa oh, Schnee. Oh. Right? We have uh, him playing the piano. Uh, that's a statue where Weiss was training. That's I don't know, just general hallways. Maybe like a long distance. Yeah. Uh, her with her correct ponytail in the back. Yep. Right. Instead of off to the side. Yep. Right. You have Jacques and Mama Shni. You have the. Uh, this is. This looks like the them two at the dust mine. Yep. Pretty interesting. Pretty cool stuff in the background. Manticore. Got a Beowulf. A Beowulf. A Beowulf. So passes by a worker. Goes in her office, and we get to meet. 
Mama Schnee. Mama Schnee. So at this point, it's very interesting with these two, their dynamic. Mm -hmm. Because if you look at their dynamic, like, um, she's human, but she's trying to be robotic. While Penny is a robot trying to be human. human. Yeah, so it's very, true. it's, they're playing, they want what the other one has. She's trying to play, er, I see what you're saying. She's trying to have emotion, no emotion, while the other one's trying to have emotion. I see what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. So she made a comment. She says, um, I let my emotions get over, like, overpower me. And then he was like, what do you mean? She's like, oh, you wouldn't understand. And Penny was like, oh, because I'm a, I'm a bot. I don't, yeah. of course, I don't get emotions. And yeah, she's yeah. like, and she's like, whoa, no, 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 that's not what I meant. That's not what I meant. Yeah, not what I meant. Yeah. Not what I meant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> close call there, Winter, but at least you're, you know, still yeah. human. She's like, no, nah, you just don't understand how it is to be a, a, so, a white area, which is neat. Her name is Willow. Willow. Willow she. Schnee. Um, apparently, she is a very powerful summoner. So really, I think she scales stronger than, um, from what I've been told, she's mm. she scales stronger than uh, like Winter. Oh wow. Maybe. So. She just, but she just drinks now. <laughs> I, I don't chill with the drinks. <laughs> so. Um, she put cameras for her safety, right? Mm -hmm. And uh, so we can assume maybe it was because uh, maybe domestic mm. abuse or something that she was trying to make sure she had film of. Um, she was like, yo, there was a man here, um, you know, pretty sketchy. And then she's like, don't forget about your brother. Yeah. Uh, you know, you left him here with us. Yeah. Well, like, I'm a drunk and that guy's a crap. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So don't forget about him. <laughs> yeah. And then it's raining. Yeah. Because it's hot mm -hmm. down here. All this red stuff, that's heat. That's the heating grid. Yeah. yeah. So he goes and he, he has access to. Remember, he has he has security clearance. Yeah. He has Jacques security clearance. Yep. Right. He's everything. The heating is in partnership with. Atlas. The dust company, the Schnee oh, Dust Company. Yeah. So he's like, so right now he's like, mm, turn that crap off. You know, it's like. <laughs> Enough to make it stop raining. It turns straight And to immediately snow. snow. Oh, look, you have the two drunks down there? <laughs> I don't know if you saw them. Yeah, right yeah, yeah. <laughs> Watts is like, hmm, have fun. Have fun, the snow kids, for about an hour. And then die. And remember, they they might not have ever really seen snow before. Yeah. So, I mean, it depends on how old this kid is. I don't know if he's ever been out. In, yeah. I doubt he's been in the tundra, but, you know. Yeah, yeah, He might know of it. But, like, they're all looking up, they're like, what? Like, uh, what? So, Man, dude, Watts is wild so for that, bro. He turned off the heat. He said, nope, you're gonna freeze to death. Dang, Watts so, is smart, though. <laughs> so what do you think happens now? Um, well, I think they're gonna catch it before it kills everybody, but they're going to, um... They're gonna, it's gonna open their eyes, I guess, the team, and they're gonna be like, yeah, we gotta figure out who this is, like, now. Because this is getting out of hand. And they might be able to piece together. Because, I mean, it's literally right after Jacques became council. So mm -hmm. maybe they'll be able to piece something together there. Like, why all of a sudden is this dude got... Are, are we losing, you know... What you would call it? Why are we... How are our systems getting broken into all of a sudden? Like, this is... Something has to be linking up somewhere that we're missing. And Weiss is already kind of on it. Like, she knows something's up with her dad. And on top of, she's got footage now of him sitting down with some dude, Watts, talking. So, she hit play. So, I guess they can hear the footage, I guess, off that phone. I'm guessing the cameras pick up audio. So, she's about to hear what was said. So yeah, Maybe. So, we're about to learn. We're about to see what happens. I don't but know. So, so, let's go with uh, the people in Mantle. Uh -huh. What do you think they're going to do? Mantle? Because uh, their heat just, current, just turned off. They're probably going to freak out. They're going to go insane. I mean, they're probably gonna not know what to do with themselves. But, okay. But 
I don't know. I don't know. I mean, they're obviously going to riot. I think they're going to riot and try to complain to Atlas, I guess. I don't know. Try to get to Atlas and, you know, you know what's going on? Why is there heat? Because Atlas, yeah, Atlas controls the heat. So it's like, what, since we, what, since Robin didn't win, now we're all just nothingness now? We're just going to kill us all? And what happens with, like, rioting? Grim. So, yeah. <laughs> Straight just negativity. Just remember, anything negative, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's like, it's, it's, there's Grim. Yeah. And, <laughs> you can never forget that, yeah, ever. It's always going to be a... Uh, never uh, forget that. Play it. Anytime the ass Salem's playing, what's There's literally plan? plan A. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Plan one. Plan first. Why you know, like Grim? Because if they kill Grim, guess what I can do? What? Just make more. Like, they just infinitely spawn. Like... <clears throat> Yeah, it doesn't like they just they just spawn and themselves. And then we know that she can she can modify the Grim too. So it's like a Grim can come up the pool and she goes, you know what? He needs wings. Oh, you know what? You need a big head. Why? You just need a big head. You're going chibi, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah you get a big head. And then <laughs> you want to? I want you to look cute, okay? Yeah, and then you, on the other hand, what? You're just gonna have one big toe. Rip. Why? Just want you to have a big toe. I don't know. I just feel like it. <laughs> She's, she's, feel like she's like she's like playing like Sims with like the freaking grim. Like, oh, makes like no, she's, hey, look, I'm gonna make one really good looking, and then we're gonna see how ugly I can make one. Watch this. Make some old like giant. I'd be bad eyes. if I was Salem. I'd just be pitting them against each other. Let's see. I'm gonna take that one, and now we'll see who wins. I would literally have like eight of them. Just be like, all right, battle royale. Uh, I'll upgrade whoever wins. Yeah, yeah. I'll upgrade whichever species wins first. All right, and go. they'd just be like, <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, yeah, this is fun, man. Because then you can you, you, you also figure out what the strongest breed is, too. Like the strongest breed of Grim. You'd be like, well, let's see which the strongest one is. Okay. I think they have different situations. Oh, they're all, yeah, like, they're all situational. I like if you went with like, uh, like the Goliath Grim, the giant elephants yeah. in, uh, in Volume 2 that were like slowly walking. Yeah. Um, I guess and also in Volume 3. But like those are more tanky looking. Yeah. So they said that Ruby Sniper wouldn't do anything. Yeah, I mean they're, they're all they they would be almost good for like a situation like I guess mantle if they wanted like you wanted like a grim to just destroy a city like those mm -hmm. could just like run through buildings and destroy buildings and stuff. But then you have like the we've already seen the saber tooth grim <laughs> right so those are more like fast agile like pinpoint you yeah, know yeah, like yeah. hit you have the flying ones yeah right which can you know sweep. I said the elephants could destroy towns. No, you got leviathans and bubbles who are not bubbles, bubbles and um, well, the, I think those are like extreme cases. Yeah, I mean that's what I'm saying. Those are like because those are like the omegas <laughs> or yeah, like whatever you want to go. Because you have yeah, like yeah. you have like because you can get like God, a dude. Wolf. Could you imagine like that coming out of the pool one day? Like you're just chilling like at home, like Sam, and then just thing just that comes rising out. No, because the they, they grow. They grow oh. and evolve. So you're telling me that a Leviathan at one point was not that big? Uh, I don't know. I, don't I think, it. I think it, it might be the same species, but we've seen baby Nevermore, and we've seen big Nevermore. Oh, that's true. They, they have been baby Nevermore. You're right. But oh. then again, we've also seen full, fully grown Beowulfs come out the... The pools. The pools. And also the big gorillas. So, they came straight out the thing. Yeah. Full size. So, yeah. But then again, true. maybe she's double dipping. Yeah. Maybe yeah, she's yeah. like taking like a Beowulf and go back in there. You know, it's like, like infant child. <laughs> Teenage. Adult. Grandpa. Okay, there we go. Like, wait, what? Is that how that works? <laughs> and grandpa with wings. It's like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Is that how that works? Like she's like, wait a second. So the more I dip them, the stronger they. Get. She just keeps dipping herself in. She just keeps dipping herself in. <laughs> I'm, I'm assuming at some point Salem has probably jumped back into the pool. She's she like after. Have. She's like, please kill me. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> I just want to die. More grim power. More grim power. She's like, I just want to die. <laughs> just kill me. Yeah, just like the scene I, or that movie I told you about, where it's the Happy Death Day, where she just like mm. because she knows when she dies, she just gonna repeat <laughs> the same day over. So she just started purposely killing herself. Just She's like, just kill me. Yeah, so my like, favorite scene in that whole movie is where she walks up in a store like a grandma shopping, and she's like looking at items, and then she just strip grabs like a bottle of bleach. And, like, she looks drinks the, it. Yeah, yeah. She looks at the old lady and goes, "How's your day going? Good. All right, my, I'm about to finish mine right now." And the girl's like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that'd be, that's definitely Salem's vibes. <laughs> I love every time Salem's on screen. Oh, yeah. So great. Yeah, she's a savage. Anyway, so we're going to move on. Um, 
if you guys can do all the algorithm stuff, liking, commenting, and subscribing will really help us out. Join the Ruby Reactors Discord if you're looking for more reactors, or if you are a reactor looking to post your content somewhere, uh, do it there. And um, what else? We Twitches, Twitches, and uh, Patreon. Patreon. Yeah. If you want to uh, have some influence, or if you just want to support, um, then Patreon. That'll that'll be helpful. Yep. So other than that, we will see you all in the next one. Deuces.